underwater shade. What is that anyway? And is it important to you in summertime fishing? I'm kind of thinking anything in the summer that's got the word shade, pretty important. Good morning, guys and girls. July 29. July 29, Ecclesiastics. Ecclesiastics was written by uh, uh, King Solomon. King Solomon and Ecclesiastics 2.26, here's what he says. God gives wisdom and knowledge and joy to a man who is good in his sight. God gives wisdom, knowledge, and joy to a man who is good in his sight, in God's sight. That's who we want to be good. We want to be good in God's sight because we know that God is always looking. So we want to be good when he's looking. Here's what I wrote about that. During the 21 years, by the way, we're talking to the Catch a Better Life book. Uh, this Catch a Better Life book is available about everywhere. Uh, you can check it out on jimmyhouston.com, Amazon, just about anywhere books are sold. During the 21 years of Bass and Gal tournaments, I was amazed at how much knowledge and skills so many of the women developed over the years. I mean, it was just amazing. You could see them getting better. You just watch them get better from year to year and tournament to tournament. Their catches and their joy increased. We see the same thing with our kids, our grandkids, our great-grandkids. We see them as we try to teach them how to do things in fishing or anything else in life. We see them becoming more skilled, gaining more knowledge, and having more fun at it. We see in today's verse that all of this, wisdom, knowledge, and joy, all are a gift from God. Here's the secret to these winning benefits. We need to be and do good in God's sight. We need to be good in God's sight. We need to be doing good in God's sight. That's how we get wisdom, knowledge, and joy. Can we do that? Can we actually do that? You bet we can. Absolutely we can. We tell the truth. And we're faithful. We're loving. We're forgiving. And we're humble. We help others. We're patient and kind. When we put a smile... When we put a smile on God's heart, he'll put a smile of wisdom. He will put a smile of knowledge. He will put a smile of joy on our heart. When we do those things in front of God, and everything we do is in front of God, he will put wisdom, knowledge, and joy on our heart. Let's do some good today out there in God's sight. See what happens. Here's our tip for today. Find underwater shade, so it must be important if we're saying we need to find it. Find underwater shade to locate summertime bass. Underwater shade to be ledges, be channels, be submerged trees. Trees that we can't see above the water, but they're underwater. They create shade. You know, we can actually see those on our fish finder nowadays. We can look on our fish finder. You can do it on a side scan. You can go on down vision. You can also obviously see it on a front vision. But you can actually see that shade. You can see the dark spots on your fish finders today that we used to couldn't see that. You can see that shade. And, uh, and that's the areas where a lot of the bass will be. Now, if that shade is there, a lot of times you're not going to be able to see the fish. But if you'll fish in that shade, just like, you know, today, you're going to get really, really hot. Today, if you'll fish in the shade, probably going to have a better chance to catch a fish you're fishing in the sun. The submerged shade that you can only see with your fish finders, that's the shade I'm talking about. And you bet, Lucille, very, very important. Guys and girls, go out there and have you a great one today. And remember, I sure do love you.